Hey guys, uh, you know, it's the end of the day. We're a little hammered here. <laughs> uh, look what just came in. We just got our V. We, we were expecting this for a while. Just came in. It's uh, number 1017. From what I understand, the last two numbers are the numbers. So there's 81 of these guys made. I guess this is number 17. And this is Murphy Lab. I had my guys over there uh, give me a special attention on getting one the way I wanted it. It's a light age, but it's, you know, got a pretty fair amount of aging, um, you know, weather checking. Man, they really did this up. They did a beautiful case with it. With and the they did the too. case cover as well, yeah. the canvas cover. And uh, so Michael was just fooling around with it a second ago. Sounds great. Yeah, how does that yeah. feel to you? The neck is probably the best one I felt on Phenomenal. a Phenomenal. Yeah. Let's see the back though That's real quick. That's the first thing I noticed about it. Yeah, really comfortable neck. And the way they got the patina on the hardware, too. Yeah, that look little at bit this. of green in there it looks really good. Yeah, so it's, um, you know, it's kind of aged just right. It really reminds me of other Vs that I had real ones. It so really they does. really did a hell of a job on this. And uh, The neck is crazy. Though. Yeah. It's just absolutely the real thing. How's the weight? Light and very easy. <laughs> So we're going to do an official guitar of the day with this, but since this just came in, we've been anxious to do a little video with this, um, so we just want to get it to you before the end of the weekend here, and uh, hopefully uh, somebody's going to be a proud owner, and I'm telling you, this is about as close as you can get to a real V, Brazilian fingerboard, um, just the right amount of aging, and the neck feels just right. How does that feel cranked up a little bit more? Amazing. Let's see what we get. Put it on 10. Put it on 10, Joe Von Amasa style. <laughs> direction yeah, yeah really, really 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 cool doing piece. a great job um, congratulations to them congratulations to my buddy Mark over there I'm sure he's involved with a lot of this stuff yep. getting stuff right because he's really uh, he knows the stuff he's seen enough real ones so he knows he what's knows happening. the stuff yeah. yeah and this one I mean there's such a snap to the attack but it's still yeah. it's so warm still it's just great tone Great playability. You could even do a jazz gig on a flying V. Yeah. You could, you could. Let's hear it, Lem. A little loud. But... Yeah. So, you know, when these things came out, these things were so futuristic. Um, there was the V, the Explorer, and the Modern, and uh, the thing about them is that they were just, you know, most of the guys that were playing who were pro players were playing archtop guitars, so they didn't get it, and it was just too futuristic. Didn't go over good in the beginning, and that's why they only made a very limited amount. This is 81, I think they're making of this right now, and uh, I think it's going to be a pretty good investment, because I know people are already selling them above uh, retail, we don't want to do that here at Arms Repertoires. We want to be the good guys, but I'm telling you, somebody's going to probably do okay with this guitar. So uh, this is it. The, uh, this commemorative uh, collector's edition Murphy Lab Light Aged Flying V Carina Wood Brazilian Board. That's the kind of stuff. You know, I don't recommend doing jazz gigs with Vs. You know why? Because they don't pay those guys no enough money to up. play. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyhow, guys been do a jazz gig. With a Grant, a Grant we, could we get away it. with it. Yeah. So, but anyhow, there you go, a little humor at the end of the day. We're a little hammered, but love you guys. Thank you for watching and thanks for putting up with our nonsense. And uh, thanks, Brandon, putting up with Brandon. <laughs> With a limo. <laughs> Thanks, guys. My buddy over here, Look Leonard. This guy. Oh, what? He got the Madurn. Is he? Yeah, yeah. Are you coming in here to rob us? We're in the mail. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, that's Leonard. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. See y'all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, with the real Madurn too. Yeah, yeah, that's great.